So here we have uh, another important tree in the Caledonian forest, which is quite rare, uh, but should be very much more common. It's an aspen tree, and its Gallic name actually means the shaking tree. It's deciduous, so the leaves uh, will fall in the, in the autumn time, and they generally go a fantastic color of some sort. It depends uh, which individual, but they often go bright yellow or bright red. Um, the leaves are attached to the rest of the tree by a long stalk. That's one of the ways you can tell that it's an aspen and when the breeze blows through them they sh the leaves shimmer like uh, the wave about like flags flutter in the breeze. Aspens are uh, unusual uh, for many plants isn't in that they're either male or females and that has consequences for uh, its setting seed uh, particularly in Scotland and it's one of the reasons why we're particularly interested in aspen is that uh, it's very hard to find seed in Scotland. Uh, and the most important part of the tree is actually underground. So uh, if you can imagine this is, this is the land, underneath here is the rootstock. And the rootstock is virtually indestructible unless you use a man-made uh, toxin to kill it. Uh, so it's related to the willows produces little catkins uh, in the late spring uh, which then fluff up as they as they as they get uh, pollinated and uh, the seeds are distributed by wind so, so just like a dandelion clock for instance so um, a really important tree